guys welcome to the vlog um mitch and i just finished up a workout over at 24 i did glutes and shoulders pretty good workout focused on my glutes because i have been lacking on them and they are sore so i think we did a really good job today we had a notification that we had some parcels pending i just got in my maternity pillow and i am so stoked mitchell may not be that excited because it's complete barrier between the two of us but i'm so excited for it and then we also got in um Bella's little doggy gate so that she can be sectioned off when needs to be, um, especially for whenever the baby's here. I'm really excited to open these. Look how big my pillow comes in, and that's the doggy gate. So, like, massive. Both of these were ordered off of Amazon. Oh, very excited. Oh, are you gonna come over here? how great this is oh my gosh I'm gonna sleep like a baby from now on oh and it's so soft I got the blue and the gray there was like um an all white one and then there was I think like a lighter color one and I just went for blue and gray neutral whatever and it's massive like whew, I'm so stoked this so far been my favorite gift to myself Dakota I think she's gonna like it too. She's definitely gonna benefit from this. Oh, hell yeah. Our bed's a mess, but look at that beauty. Oh, yes. I cannot wait to see you tonight. Dakota, try not to enjoy it too much. Dakota's food is in here because Bella will drink all of her water and pee immediately if it's out in the kitchen. Mitchell and I yesterday booked our baby moon, which is going to be our last trip before baby gets here. So just like a him and I trip, um, just to relax, enjoy each other, and just breathe and enjoy it. So we just booked that, which I'm so excited about, and I'll share more about that with you. Um, that's going to be the second week of May, and it's so needed. And we have stagecoach this weekend, so we have lots of things going on on top of about some parents. So, yes. Um, Mitchell and I are on our way to Stagecoach right now. It's almost four o'clock, a little later than planned, but it's like 103 degrees out, so I'm not too upset about having to sit in the, sit in the sun. We have to go get chairs, and then we'll be off. I'm super excited. Little, little baby, baby girl. We do have her name picked out. I'll show you guys with that in a little, but I'm super excited for this weekend. And I finally found a hat that fits my head. These hats, like, never, ever fit my head. So I'm really glad I found one. I hope it turned out right. Yay! We'll probably have to put glitter on it. Cute! Nice! We'll do the Tegan sign, and then these are gonna... Little circles are gonna be draped over top of it. And then this is gonna be our little balloon arch. All the stuff we got on Etsy. We just got back from my grandma's house where we're gonna be doing the baby shower at. We went over some of the details for like the table, um, where things are gonna be setting up, who's bringing what. Some of these flowers are going to be lining the tables and they're so pretty um so yeah day off we have a somewhat busy day we're going to go see some of our friends in newport they're down here from arizona um mitchell clean the house and then yeah just getting the baby shower stuff pretty much set kick that open Ready to get our craft on? Craft on. Craft on. <laughs> We're going to all the Joann's and trying to find this to line or to 
do a table runner with. No, it's too um, peachy. Too peachy. Grabbing some stuff for baby shower. Um, and we're gonna do the the size of mommy's belly, and then because it's co-ed, we're gonna do it for Mitchell. So I'm gonna get some blue and pink yarn. And he doesn't know he's gonna play in that game, but we're gonna see how big his belly is. What a cutie. Carry around pink stuff. I need that. I like this color, but we don't need that big of it. Is there a smaller pink bundle? Just over it. This one is resonating with me. Hey! Yesterday I stopped recording after we did some baby shower shopping. I went to the gym. Or sorry, I did not go to the gym. I went to work and then the gym. Last night we tanned, did my hair, so I'm feeling good. Honestly, a tan takes me from like bleh to like So if you ever really need this little boost, honestly, I highly recommend getting a tan. I just use a tanning mousse and I love it. Um, and I just sleep with it whenever I go to bed and then I just wash it off in the morning, like rinse it off. But I'm at the gym again and do a workout and then we have a full day of errands, baby shower, baby update, talk to you guys a little bit about the bump. Yeah, I'm really excited. I want to do more recording for YouTube and just share this process and journey. One thing I will acknowledge of why I haven't been is because I have a really old and slow MacBook Pro and I'll edit it and upload it. And then my video, like the audio and my mouth will not sync. So it just throws it off and then I have to re-edit and then upload and see if it works. So it does get de pretty defeating, but I'm going to be getting a new computer soon. Hopefully within this week. And then that won't be an issue. And then vlogs will be more up to date and more current. And we can stay relevant with the progress. So I'll pick back up with you guys after this workout. <laughs> I finished the gym, did a really good shoulder, bicep, and a little bit of tricep workout. Went to Laguna, where I'm at now, and I had lunch at Earth Cafe. The Caprice you saw, and then a mango pineapple banana smoothie with boba. Now I'm doing a little bit more baby shower work. I want to get these macaroons, which I love, and then get the baby's name written across it. Um, and the place in Laguna, they can't do them, so I'm hoping to find someone else to do them. If not, we might do cupcakes, or I don't really know yet, but this is what I'm doing. And then because I'm doing two baby showers, because I have divorcee parents, uh, I'm going to go check out the second venue right now that I'll be doing with my mom for the baby shower that we'll be planning. 3 o'clock, I work at 9 tonight, so I got 6 hours, I want to take a nap, I want to study for an ACE. So I can get legit certified, I can start doing programs, baby program, you know, while you're pregnant, a bounce back body program. So lots of things to do before baby's here. And we got 12 weeks till she's due. I cannot believe that. Are you excited that you have the house back to yourself for the day? Oh, you're such a baby. Huh. I picked up two vanilla and a red velvet. For Mitchell and myself when he gets home. It's now five o'clock. Traffic was cray cray. I think I'm gonna take a nap and then start studying and then um, make some food and then head off to work. I have an in inventory shift, so that means I'm working until 2 a.m. So it's a long night. So at the gym, lately, Tegan, our baby girl's name, she has been kicking a ton late at night. So right now it's almost eight o'clock and I can start to, I'm starting to feel her like move around and squirm a little bit. And this has happened twice now where I've been at the gym. It was two nights ago working out and I was doing shoulders and I was sitting on a bench and she was moving around so much in my stomach, just like tumbling around, kicking, like just being super active. And although I love feeling her, it got to that point where it was kind of like uncomfortable because like I kind of like cramp a, a little bit like ah uh, she's moving and like my stomach obviously is just like moving around. So these past two nights I've been at the gym I've cut my workout early. So I'm hoping tonight she's just going to stay subtle and just light movements 
and then I can get through a quick workout, but be intentional with my movements. But I love feeling her kick, so like I wouldn't change that for the world. But I wish that our timing for gym and movement just didn't overlap some days. So get to this workout. I had to share that with you guys. If you are pregnant too, I would love to just hear some of your stories, comments, like whatever you're experiencing. Tomorrow I'm 28 weeks, so I will be third trimester. Every Wednesday, I'm a week closer to my due date if you guys care to keep track or if that's just fun knowledge. So, tomorrow, 28 weeks, third trimester, home stretch, 12 weeks. Holy fuck. <sighs> okay, Jim, let's get it done. Yeah, it's our time to shine. So that's the kind of state of mind you gotta combine with hard work and time. You gotta climb to the top. Don't let yourself drop till your heart stops. Let this beat rock. Got a new clock and a new stock for this new rock. Just let your mind loose from the new stock. Drunk off the goose. Yeah. Thinking that I'm too pumped. Yeah. Getting caught with a few thoughts. Cause, Cause I'm, I'm too lost. Off. Speakers can't even handle me. Even what I got, nobody will drain my energy. And I will never stop. I'm motivated by enemies. Setting up shops so everybody remember me. And now I am not going through life. Regretfully, I'd rather work not. Stop what they call incessantly Then what's a more job Just to live life pleasantly Already got lost in my mind Not a fantasy I'm getting the forgotten soul So stop dropping roll Yeah, lost all control And pop off your bowl I got squat, I fold I'm not bought, I'm sold My stock rocks, it's gold Hey, knock, knock, she hold It's shit, talk to close I ain't stopping though It's hip-hop, you know Or is it rock and roll? I'm not dropping dough No, my pockets grow You can't stop the show So get rocked, you know So let me break, break, break it all down for you I never give it In my own section and they still disconnected Cause their mind's been infected and they're filled with objection Too filled for recollection so we're losing all attention They don't know I'm in contention cause I'm gaining their attention Cause I'm making a connection Lyricism and aggression got me feeling my ascension In my passion, my profession I'm attacking my obsession Taking action and progressing uh, I go off on the enemy That's what makes them scared of me Make my plans carefully then execute them daringly They say I act recklessly but that's why I'm effective See you can't predict my tendencies I offer no transparency Some people think I'm lost but this thing will be a legend I'm so I'm at Mother's, I'm gonna grab a shake and some dinner because we have nothing at the house because we're going on a trip. So I'm gonna grab some food right now. Just picked up a apple juice, mango, pineapple, and soy protein smoothie, and then a mango. Fruit platter, half-calf coffee, my nails are shit, I know, don't look. And then a apple raisin oatmeal is a breakfast. Baby shower, we got a hundred pack. And then another Polaroid camera. I'm picking up a new MacBook, so I got this adapter. So we were down in Laguna because, as you know, we are leaving for a baby moon on Sunday and it's out of the country and I have my passport. So we checked my mom's house, not there. Um, hopefully it'll be in the safety deposit box, but fingers crossed. So right now we're at Best Buy, pick up a new computer because the one that I have is like from middle school, so it's time for an upgrade. And then we're gonna get this guy. Um, do you just wanna wait a second for that? Because if Nancy can't find my password, I have to go to the post office anyway. So I am very stressed right now. Aside from getting a new computer and getting the um, Polaroids, we have a few more errands to do and I can't find my password in my house. My mom just went to her safety deposit box and it's not in there. I'm hoping she knows where it's at in the house because we leave in two days and it's on Sunday so it's a weekend and I'm just like fully stressed out right now. So I'm really hoping this baby moons happens because I need it even more so with how much stress I just put on myself with how last minute 
I'm just doing everything. So yeah, Mitchell went back to the post office. Um, he needed to grab something else to do a drop off. Um, and then hopefully my mom gives me good news and then we can just continue with the errands throughout the day. If not, I'm figuring out where to go for a 24 hour passport turnover. Fingers tight. That, uh, what was that? I know. It would have been. It looked pretty good. So this is where I'm going to conclude the vlog. I was just shopping at Lush for some of the baby shower gifts to give to friends and family that came to celebrate with me and Mitchell um, for our baby girl Tegan. I have been loving my MacBook. I bought myself the MacBook Pro 13-inch 2018 version and I have been loving it. Um, it just makes editing and uploading so much easier for me so I'm really excited to get more YouTube videos out keep you guys up to date with what's going on with me, with Tegan, with my life, and just changes so that we can all be up to date with the journey. Tomorrow, actually this whole entire week, we, um, I'm adding this into the video, but we are back from our baby moon already and we have to start packing up now. So it's gonna be a really busy week. Lots to share, lots to talk about, lots to update you guys with, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys are enjoying my workouts now that I'm preggers. If you aren't pregnant, you can still definitely do all these workouts they just are a little bit more tailored, a little bit more modified to be more comfortable um, for me and like my body and my bump and just positions and stances and things like that. But you're more than welcome to do them. Give them a try. Let me know if you guys do. Um, and I'm going to conclude the vlog here. I hope you guys have enjoyed it and I'll see you guys for the baby moon.